Today on Beta Squad, we're here to find out who the best liar is. To help us do that, we have Mark. Mark, do, do, do you want to explain the rules, Mark? Gentlemen, beside you on the table, you will find a whiteboard and some numbered cue cards. These will have your name on them. Each cue card has a question. You will have 30 seconds to answer. However, one of you gentlemen will have a card that's different from the other four. This person is the imposter. I will ask each of you to actually write down the answer and reveal them to me individually. Once all answers have been revealed, you will then get three minutes to discuss amongst yourselves and try to discover who is the imposter. Each person that identifies the imposter will gain one point. However, if the imposter deceives all of you, they gain two points. Is all of this understood, gentlemen? Yes, sir. Yes, yes. Okay, gentlemen, pick up your first cue card. Oh, oh wow. Already. Three, Start like that. two, one. Ooh. Oh, I don't actually know. Good question, this is. I don't know. Three. <laughs> right answer. <laughs> two. <laughs> One. Right answer, Nico. Pens right. down, gentlemen. Oh, it's too controversial. AJ, can we see your answer, please, sir? It's quite... Uh... Show your answer, man. Jack the Ripper. Crazy. Jack the Ripper. That is uh, mental. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. Kanye. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Sharky, your question, please, sir. Freddie Mercury. Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> Jackson. Damon Wayne. <laughs> oh, I think I know what's going on. <laughs> what's the question? And the question was, who is your favourite celebrity? Jack no. the Ripper! Wait, <laughs> why? Jack the Ripper was your favourite celebrity. What's why is your favourite celebrity? <laughs> ah, <laughs> I'll give you three minutes now to discuss amongst yourselves. We don't need, we don't need three minutes. Uh, Mark, 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 Mark. Jack the Ripper, favourite celebrity. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us how much, why you love Jack the Ripper. Yeah, go on, go on. <laughs> do you know on, AJ. How do you even answer this? Yeah, no, no, no. AJ, you can convince me. You, you admire his tenacity, driven, resilience. No, no, no. He doesn't get caught for his crimes just like you. Listen, I don't want to speak because um, I feel like my next few words are, I have to be very careful with. Every one of us would have tried to find a way <laughs> to convince everyone. I said this is about who the best liar is in Vegas, but we already know clearly someone who definitely isn't. What, what was your question? Who's the most fam famous serial killer of all time? <laughs> <laughs> we all clearly vote AJ, I think we all get one point. Yeah, but to be fair, it's like a, that's like a nice little starter to show you. Honestly, do, you, do any of you not think you could have done that? Yeah, I would have tried, I would have tried, I would have tried. Okay, gentlemen, I think that's unanimous. So can you please answer question number two? Oh, second one. What kind of question? That is quite an interesting question. Okay, can we start with you, Nico? Can you please show us your answer? This is mine. Two. Two? AJ. Five. Wow. Sharky. 80. <laughs> Kenny. Two. <laughs> Two. <laughs> the question that four of you had was, how many people can you take on in a fight at once? Oh, so I want to know. Okay. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. How can you take an 80 man? It didn't say what kind of people. I thought like kids. Because obviously the question is how many people you could take on, right? And I think 80 newborn babies I could smoke. You want to fight how newborn would, babies? How would, how would you lose the 90 newborn babies? I just think 90 is just a tipping over the edge. To be fair, I've also got a problem with AJ's answer. You think you can take out five people? Depends what kind of five guys they are. There's no way in hell AJ depends, can. Depends though, it depends. I don't know, it could be AJ lying here, you know? I think so, yeah. I could take five guys. That's crazy, you could take five guys. So you can take five times? Chill, chill, chill. Pause the whole thing. <laughs> whole set, pause it. Because all you have to remember, bro, is just one crazy bang. Yeah, and, and then just... the other one you can finish. And then it's one on one, you get it? To be fair, I... Kenny, I'm expecting more from you. What? He's a human being. No, he trains every day. Yeah, so do I. What's the point if you can only take two men? Yeah, bang one oh, out and then the other one you just scrap. You should be able to take at least 10. Nick, I can't take two guys at yeah, once. Yeah, I don't know. Come on. Listen, listen, guys, listen, listen. I took, I, I took the average. The average height for a man is a five foot eight. I have to base that off the closest to five foot eight, who I know, and that's AJ, who's five foot four. Nice, nice, nice. I could smoke two, maybe three AJs. So that's the how logic. About me, how about me? You go right here, right yeah, now. Go right now. Go right now. Where you going? I'm strapped to the you're thing. Lucky, you're, you're lucky. lucky. Oh, you're lucky. AJ, would you give us your vote, please? I vote Sharky. And Nico, would you please give us your vote? Oh, Mark, I'm going to vote for Sharky as well. And Sharky. Uh, uh, AJ, five guys and what's not? No chance. And you can take eighty. For 80 kids here. Sharky. And Chunks, lastly. I uh, went for AJ. I think the only five guys you can take for the burger. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, the imposter was Sharky. Uh, and the question that he had was how many crisps? 
could you eat in 20 seconds? <laughs> yeah, I could score. But I took it as like single, like crisp. Whoa, even that's cat. You can't do eight. 20 seconds. Seconds. Right, second. I Have we got any crisps on set? Crisps here. Have we got crisps? Hey! I already got caught as the liar. Why do I have to prove no, it? No, because I just want to see that. Let's bring in the crisps. Oh, they're nice ones. Oh, no, ready sorted. All right. So I have to try and do this, yeah? You got 20 seconds, yeah? Remember uh, that. All right, Sharky, yeah? In three, two, one, one go. go. Yeah, 80, yeah? That's about five so far. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, yeah. 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 yeah, good one, man. Yeah, yeah, What's yeah, that, 20 yeah, seconds? Yeah. No, look. He's <laughs> <laughs> a liar, Not, man. You didn't even finish a packet. You know you could have saved yourself if you were just reasonable with the amount. You had about four and a half. <laughs> Question number three on three, two, one. I've got my answer. I don't know about you guys, but I've got mine. Three, two, one. AJ, can we see your answer, please? Uh, my answer is 50 cent. And Nico? Uh, I'm going to go for Kanye. And Sharky? Ed Sheeran. Kenny? Tyler, the creator. And finally, <laughs> Chunks. The uh, Frozen John, Elsa. <laughs> <laughs> There's one person that has a different answer compared to everyone else. <laughs> the question that four of you had was, who was your favourite music artist between 2010 and 2015? And to discuss... <laughs> when did it come out? When did Frozen come out? Was that no, uh, no, it was... Uh, oh, it might have been. It might have been. Yeah, oh, clearly you're a big fan. Of course, I used to work at Cineworld when me and my brother AJ were. Remember AJ? Good time. I remember that time, but Frozen was not at that time. Was it not? Nope. <laughs> it might have been, I think I'm it was. I'm pretty sure it was, bro. Why well, was that like, your favourite music artist? Bear in mind, I used to clean screens. So when I'm cleaning it non-stop, I'm just hearing, let it go. I said, rhythm. When I was en route to school, at uh, not school, sorry, work, Spotify. What, 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 what are the truths that you have for to be your favourite artist? But that, for me, it was number one on my Spotify for the year. So Elsa was clear of uh, Drake? Clear. What did Drake do in 2015? <laughs> 2013 was nothing was the same. And for me, after that, he kind of dropped off. So I kind of had to find a new artist and uh, Elsa, Frozen, let it go <laughs> for me. I never knew you were a super fan. Super fan. Play so that what, song. What, I know um, what's the uh, snowman called in Frozen? Jeffrey. <laughs> <laughs> Olaf, yeah? Olaf? Yeah, yeah, it's Olaf. You should have had this answer though. <laughs> I'll be honest, I've never heard AJ talk about 50 Cent. Ah, right, come on, 50 bro. Cent. Name me three 50 Cent songs. Uh, 2010, 2015, what was he doing 2015? Bro, that's who I listened to at that time. Let's not talk about me, bro. Ah, you're lying. Name three 50 Cent songs. Let me buy you a drink. That's T Pain. Pain. Oh, oh that? my God! And you lot are trying to get on to me like I didn't tell you about Frozen. Oh, okay. What about what's his name? Many men. That's one. Yeah. Uh, okay. And when's that? Candy shop. That's two. Uh, one more. Uh, one more. The two pack. Two pack. I uh, man them. Man them. He said 2010 to 2015. He didn't name one song that 50 Cent. I oh, no no no. They're all like. And you lot are trying to get on to me. I liked his music. You don't. You see, and you lot are trying to get on to me. I don't me. know the names, man. I know you the songs. You lot are getting on to me. But he, he's just weird. That, but act. This is my. Rhythm. I don't know the name of the song. Let it go. You're just trying to save yourself. Can we have your votes, please? Starting with AJ. Well, it's chunks guaranteed. See, that's all you lot are doing, yeah. Nico. I believe that it's chunks. And chunks. I'm gonna go for chunks as see? well. Guaranteed chunks. There's no way you were listening to that then. Go pick for me again. Vote for me again, go on. And so the imposter. Wait, so I don't have a vote? <laughs> I'm begging your pardon, chunks. What is your vote? Vote for myself, Mark. And that means I get a point, right? And so, yes, I can reveal that the imposter was chunks. Yeah, what was the question? So the question that chunks had was who was your favourite Disney Channel? Artist. And he picked that. He could have said like Selena Gomez. Disney Channel. You, you telling me you'd believe if I said Selena Gomez? No, no. no way, no way. A bit more than that. Demi Lovato. I can't Miley name you one Demi Lovato tune. I wish I had that one. I could have sold that. Nah, no, I don't think you could. Can we move on now to question number four? In three, two, one. Please answer your question, gentlemen. <laughs> good question, good question. <laughs> okay, gentlemen, time to reveal your answers, beginning with you, please, AJ. Uh, Birmingham. And Nico. Telford. <laughs> hmm. And Sharky. London. And Kenny. Watford. And Chunks. Stoke. <laughs> and so, stop. the question which four of you had was which UK city has the worst people? Hey, I'll tell you the reason why I went Birmingham. I can't stand the accent. My ears bleed every time I hear the accent. No, I, I, I had the same thought, but I was just thinking, no, the actual people are nice, it's just a terrible yeah, accent. I, I, I like the, the people, but I think the accent ruins it. Watford, explain, please. No, there's a lot of rude people in Watford. You don't remember when we used to... Ah! 
<laughs> you know when we used to what? Go on. When we used to film there, remember all the like, do you not remember when me and Nico got in a scrap with that guy? That makes it the worst place. I mean, it's more valid than the accent, to be fair. Sharky, I'm confused about London. I picked London because London has the most different type of people. I think London also has the best people, but also the worst people. Oh yeah, I'm done. So why, look, now we're starting to get interested. Wait, 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 everybody go around, so give your reason what? as well. Okay, well, I think I'm probably the least likely to be the one because I went to Telford uh, for a video which I did once where I was trolling EDL members. Telford is the place where the EDL were. Oh, he did? Um, so not everyone in Telford is bad. There's a lot of great people in Telford, but EDL are there, so. Chunks, why did you go to Stoke? Stoke, because I've been there with my sister once and I remember not seeing one black brother there. So I said, yeah, there's something wrong with this place. And it's just that the way they were screw them and look at man differently, I didn't really like it. Like, that's the only place in the UK that I felt prejudiced almost. You know what I mean? My only bad experience, I think, was in Stoke. It's these two, one of these. London is a city. London, London. London, London, London. What, what was the question? Uh, what city has the worst people in the UK? Kenny, what's the, what's the question? What city is the worst place in the UK? What for? Worst place. <laughs> oh, worst city, worst place, city. That doesn't change anything. <laughs> it does, because it's the worst people. Kenny, Kenny, I don't like Kenny. I'll, I'll be honest, honest I think. Kenny got asked who what city has the best people and he repped Watford. <laughs> That's what I think. Oh, Sharky's fisting us right now. And he got asked what city has the best people oh, and he repped London. We need extra time, oh. We need extra time. Three, two, and one. AJ, can we have your vote, please? They're both bad answers. I need to pick someone. I'm going to go with Kenny. Nico. I'm going to go with Kenny. Sharky, your vote, please. I'm going to go with Kenny as well. Kenny, your vote, please. I'm going to go with Sharky. Finally, Chunks, your vote, please. I'm gonna go with Kenny, because I think he got where we born. Facts, bro. I can reveal that the imposter was Kenny. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> and Kenny's question was, what is your favorite city in the UK? <laughs> <laughs> so I'll tell you why I thought it was Kenny, because the question is, what's the worst place? It's the worst people. You almost got us a little joke, man. <laughs> we can't even write this. Uh, oh, man. This is a good one. Yeah, why not? Okay, easy answer. Yep, I agree. Beginning with you, please, AJ. The man sitting right next to me. Oh, what a coincidence, because I also went for the man sitting right next to me. <laughs> AJ. Ah, uh, say that, say Sharpie. that. Aja Shabil. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's not. Oh, come on. No, we can't. We can't. We can't. We can't. Why? 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 We can't. Why? We can't. Why? Why? Are you going to bleep my answer? No, no, no. That might be the funniest moment. I think that's the greatest one ever. Oh, my God. All right, Chugs. Both AJ Shabir and Nicholas Matlana. <laughs> okay, wait a second, now I'm confused. This is interesting. I can reveal the question for four of you was, which YouTuber's breath stinks? <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> so you have to understand, the question was which YouTuber's breath stinks? The fact that AJ says Nick all the time, Nicholas says AJ, I think it's both of them. Brother, if there's one guy who's breath, and he knows recently, it's been confirmed by a therapist, yeah? <laughs> this brother, his breath stinks. No, I, I'm tweaking. I, I can smell your breath right now. I won't lie to you. I want to move. You chucks on a swap? Nah. <laughs> I believe you got that question. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Why are you saying me? I'm literally further away. Can you not smell what's next to you? That's how strong it is, bro. Oh, chill, man. And then you went two feet. You went two feet. Yes, because the question was which YouTubers. All right, and which one's worse? I know which one's worse. Nicker. <laughs> yeah. okay, okay. Come on! I, I, that, I told me, you, I knew me, it. To me, that's confirmed it. That it's chunks because he's got two <laughs> things. <laughs> you just say that because he's upset because I chose it for stinky, stinky. You know the bad, you know the worst bit about this is because it's me and you that's cussing each other all the time saying breast things. People now generally believe I'm breast <laughs> But yours does. We all voted for either AJ or Nico here. Obviously, you have the right question. You weren't too realistic yet. <gasps> Wait, who reacted when they saw Kenny's answer? It can't be me, because I was like, yeah, we have, to, we have to get rid of that. So we know this. Huh? No, 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 no. First of all, don't try to take yourself out of it. We know it's not <laughs> I think it might be sharks. Give me one reason quickly why you're not, why you're on the clip. Because I said your breath stinks. Well, you would have went here. Why would I go here? <laughs> what you breath actually stinks. <laughs> <laughs> and if we can begin with your vote, please, AJ. I actually don't know. I, I'm hoping me and you went for each other for the joke. The, no, I'm serious, but if you're joking, then no, no. I'm glad you made that clip. No, no, your breath actually. No, 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 because you just said you were joking, so fair enough. Let that be known. You've been controlling the whole thing for what reason? Uh, no reason, I'm just answering my question. Sharks, I think it's you. I'm going to say sharks just because 
I feel like everyone else was more vocal in the reaction to Kenny's answer. Yeah, I was in shock. I'm saying Nico because he clearly just wanted to double up the votes on me. I think Chunks because it's a bit strange how we all put one yeah, YouTuber. <laughs> and it's not me. Bro. And so I, you want to call me doing stuff that no, And I got first hand ever. reaction to you. And you wasn't as uh, vocal as them, so. Yeah, because I thought I was not going to make the edit. Genuinely, that's what I thought. And Chunks. Um, for me, it's out of Nick and, and Sharky. So yeah, to avoid deadlock, I'm going to say Sharky. Oh, it was Chunks. It was Chunks. I can reveal the imposter was, in fact, AJ. Hey! <laughs> no one saw that coming. <laughs> AJ on. gets two points. Yeah! Not even one vote for me. What was the question? What was the question? Which YouTuber should win an award for best content this year? Oh, uh, look at that. And you said it's broken. I'll take that. And you said it's broken. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I said, I want to give him love, his flowers. <laughs> And then the first thing I hear is, your breast stinks. Hey, your breast stinks, yeah? And you're saying, he's the best. Uh, hey, you know, my heart hurts. Hey, AJ smashed that one, two points. And so, AJ, would you reveal your answer, please, sir? My answer is uh, the cinema with a large Coke, popcorn and ice cream. Nico. Mine is... Um... Fucking lost <laughs> Lost his whole mind. Hey, hey, how the f you do? Lost his whole mind. What the? F <laughs> <laughs> I put our address. <laughs> I put mine in Asia's address. What are you doing? <laughs> now what? Oh, everyone's gonna come to Ayadna. <laughs> um, yeah, I just put at home. So the same thing as him, but just didn't put my address. <laughs> yeah. Francis Coombe Academy. What is it? Let me see, let me see. The school, hey! He's a little bit though. <laughs> you like hanging out at schools, yeah? Cold. Hey, I, I can tell you already, where did he go to school? <laughs> and then he's at this school, and then he can be like, come in. <laughs> I said, Wembley, home. So, the question was, where is your favourite place to hang out? Kenny, let me tell <laughs> It was growing up. <laughs> your favourite place to hang out at 26 years old. He's just schooling back in this. <laughs> Why? Why did you have to go there? You know, it brings back memories. Yeah. So when do you go? Weekdays, 9 to 3 p.m.? No, no, no. I go on the weekend. Like, I do my run. Like, I go past there and I just stay there for a bit to, like... So, not your mum's house, not, no boxing, no, no nothing? No, no, I just said, when I go see my mum, I run around that area. And I... Do you go there just to look at the kids? No, there's no kids on the weekend. So, you just go to an empty school, stand outside of it, waiting for kids to come? Just to there. relive some memories. Good lie, there. <laughs> if you think again, I just don't lie. <laughs> I, I wish my answer was yours. Should we swap? Do you swap? So I leak it again? Yeah, I leak it again. There you go. Come to our yard. There's going to be one little frame where it's like not blurred for a split second and someone's going to find that. We'll take the votes now, please, gentlemen. Beginning with you. Kenny. Right Kenny. Sure. King Kennedy. I vote for myself, man. That was hard. <laughs> and the imposter was, in fact, Kenny. And Kenny's question was, where did you go to school? How was I ever going to save myself with that? That was a setup. <laughs> All right, welcome to the next round. This round is called This Is Mine. This is the round where one of our old friends has just turned up and we all have a chance to explain how we know this gentleman here. And then Mark gets to ask some questions. And at the end of that round, Mark picks who he thinks is the person. My brother. It's a long time no see, brother. Chunks, do you want to go first? Tell us who this person is and how you know him. Big Tony, good friend of mine. We worked with each other 2018, I think it was. I think he was my driver. 16, 18 months or something. I had to let him go because obviously I wasn't making the amount of funds that I could to pay off his salary. Thankfully, I'm in, I'm in a good place again. So hopefully, rehiring on the table. But it's nice to see you, bro. Long time. Mr. Noriega, that is uh, my maths teacher. Noriega. <laughs> What's funny? Why are you laughing at my tell teacher's you, name? I didn't start off great in maths, but towards the end, I was a great student, wasn't I? Can't say anything. Can't say anything. He's not trying, He's trying to, to ruin it. Fair enough, fair enough. This is Kevin. Uh, yeah, good, yeah, yeah. Kevin was my next door neighbour growing up. I know his sons really well, Sam and Josh. We played football together growing up. I actually moved out like six, seven years ago, so I haven't seen Kevin in a while, but I'm still in contact with his sons, so good to see you. This is my stepdad, Paul. <laughs> We've known each other for years and years. Taught me how to ride a bike. He's the dad to my sister, Tallulah. Yeah, we know each other very well. <laughs> it's crazy. 
this is Dave. He used to direct my videos and, um, <laughs> and he used to help out with Beta Squad as well. And before, sadly, going over to the Sidemen, which I'll never forgive you for. All right, so Mark, you've heard everyone. You get to ask us a few questions, maybe to narrow it down for yourself. And in a few minutes, you get to decide who you think actually knows this man here. Junks, how much was his salary? I used to pay him on a monthly basis. It was two and a half thousand pounds a month. So you're sharing that without his? Uh, it can get blurred, worst case scenario. Nico, how did he meet your mum? They met actually in a pub. No, they, they genuinely did, uh, in a place called Eckershaw, which I think they met in 2006, 2007. Okay, Sharky, so how long exactly did you know? So Mark lives in northwest London, so I moved there when I was like 12, I was in year eight, and I moved out when I lived with the Beta Squad in 2019, so about 10, 11 years. Kenny, was he a fair maths teacher? Yeah, he was, yeah. He wasn't unfair, I mean, yeah, he was a fair maths teacher. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what else to say about that. Like, AJ, <laughs> what was his specialty in filmmaking? Ideas generating. So he used to come up with the ideas and then direct them themselves. So, Chunks, what was it he drove? Uh, he used to drive my car. So I had a GLC 300D. So I didn't drive my own car, he used to drive my car for me. And so Kenny, one more question for you. How many years was he your maths teacher? He was my maths teacher from year nine to 11. And AJ, one more question. Was he any good? Of course, he was the best at his job. That's why he left. One more on the come. Are they happy together, your mum and this man? <laughs> They're not together anymore, but we're still very close. Like I said, he's the dad of my sister. Okay, well, I'm going to place next to one of you who I think is actually telling the truth. So the question is, which story does Mark think is true? And also pause the video right now and comment which base squad member you think is telling the truth. Hey, Mr. Noriega. <laughs> So Mark's placed this gentleman here behind Kenny, which means that you believe that Kenny knows this man here as Mr. Norega's math teacher. I do. Can you tell us the reason why you believe The main Kenny? reason is because it was difficult in actual fact between AJ and Kenny. The other three of you gave me far too many details. And in the lying world, that's usually a sign. Well, I have something to tell you, Mark. None of us actually know this man. And our aim was to actually lie to you and see who the best liar was. And you've picked Kenny, so Kenny gets two points. <laughs> for convincing you that he knew this man, when in fact, you're just, what's your name? George. He's just George. George. He's just George. <laughs> he actually looks like the George that we know in about 10 years. I swear he does. So the final two at the top of the leaderboard going into the next round, the head to head, is in fact AJ and Kenny. Oh, what a final that is. That's a big final. You know what it is that I don't want to be in the final of this. You lot are basically the best liars. I don't like there. lying, exactly. We've got clean hearts, we don't lie. We have clean hearts. And now it's time for the third and final round called Have You Ever. This is the round where our finalists, AJ and Kenny, who have proven that they are the best liars in the beta squad, so they'll go head to head in one final challenge where they will see if they can fool the other person. First of three points wins, and he has crowned the best liar in the beta squad. Whoa, whoa. You guys making that sound like it's a bad thing, bro. We're, we're in a final. No, no, it is a bad thing. All right, Kenny, look at your first card, and whatever it says. Close your eyes. Oh, what, so see, see through paper, yeah? Yeah, I want to see through paper. All right. My question to you is, have you ever scammed someone? <laughs> so yeah, I have. I have scammed so someone. you have scammed someone, okay? Yeah. What did you scam them off? <laughs> I don't even know if I can say it on cam, but I bleep it out, but it was a um, pay PayPal scam. <laughs> <laughs> okay, tell me how, what, where, how did you do this? So basically there's a, a refund trick that you can do. I'm not going to say any names, but someone got me involved in it. <laughs> <laughs> so what you do is there's a database online where you got... You did this whole bit, it needs to be muted. Oh my God. Okay, so, all right. That's why I said so that's I how you scam someone, yeah, yeah? Yeah, yeah? How much did you get from it? Give me a ballpark. Around five, it wasn't much. Five million. No, million? <laughs> no, 5K, it was five million. We keep you here in Vegas, God. All right, AJ. <laughs> What's the first thing you bought with that? Probably a camera. Good investment. Good investment. Look what he's doing now, he made it. Yeah. Knowing you, Kenny, that's not the type of things you do. So I think you are lying. But it was a very good lie. If you're about to tell me right now, I'll find it very funny. <laughs> <laughs> you need okay, to bring me in. Let's see who the first point goes to. Yeah, you're right, I'm lying. Oh! You almost had me though. Go on. Oh wait, I have to ask you the question. Please go on. <laughs> have you ever stolen in general? No, I actually haven't. Never stolen a thing in my life. You've never stolen in your whole life? I don't know if I believe you. Then say I'm lying. 
Wait, 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 wait. Let me go deeper into it. Oh, I don't want to go deeper. <laughs> Shut up. So you've never stolen your whole life from anyone, from somewhere, a place? Never stolen something in my life. It's a good Muslim. I think you're telling the truth. You know, you know, Kenny was genuinely thinking you were lying, yeah. and then Joke said, "Good Muslim." <laughs> <laughs> that cooks me as well. Yeah. Who here has stolen like a sweet or something? Yeah, from yeah. We all have, bro. Oh yeah, I've never. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> In 23, 1923, he was out there. <laughs> Look, have you? You know, you know what happened once? What? Um, I was like, it's not your turn. <laughs> yeah, the way he got you. He got you, Allah. Allah, he got you. Allah. All right, it's 2 0 to AJ. Kenny, you need this point, otherwise, AJ wins. <laughs> that's not even. That's, uh, that's Come not, on, Kenny, 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 Kenny! That's not fair. Kenny, uh, you're a boxer. Right. Yeah, since your boxing career, have you ever fought someone outside the ring? Yeah. Tell me the story. So, year seven. Oh. <laughs> Wait, you said, have you ever fought someone outside the ring? After your boxing. <laughs> Oh, after... Since, since boxing, have you ever fought someone outside the ring? Yeah, so when I was in it, uh, Italy, uh, Venice, someone bumped into me and it wasn't just him. There was two guys and they wanted to scrap me. It wasn't like a proper full-on like fist fight, it was more like push, like shove, because we were both drunk. Where in Italy did you go? Venice, I just told you. Outside of what place did you go um, drinking that night? What the? I don't remember that. Wait, you remember the fight, the tussle? Well, yeah, but who remembers where they go drinking when they go out? You don't remember the place where you went to go drink and have fun, but you remember a guy. Yeah? Crazy, remembering guys. Well, yeah, remembering because... guys, that's what you did. <laughs> who were you with? Were you with a guy? Yeah. You're not giving me much information. I wasn't a girl. <laughs> <laughs> is that it? I feel like that's a true story. You just tried to make it a bit more exciting saying that you did stuff when you didn't. Um, that's what happened. So your answer's true. Yeah, I'm lying though. Oh. <laughs> AJ, you need us to win. Have you ever thought about leaving Beta Squad? Oh! <laughs> the man that made a whole fuss online for no reason, and he's still here. <laughs> <laughs> you know that issue's actually real? Uh, yes. What made you want to leave? I don't know if I should mention this on camera. Yeah. <laughs> so Nick put a... Uh... Nick put what? <laughs> <laughs> You're tweaking heavy. State the point, man. <laughs> <laughs> what the f was I supposed to do there? All right, it's 2-2. Two, two. So whatever happens now, we're going to find out the winner. Oh, this is so dead. Oh, wait, let's all so unite nice. hands and mouth. Let's go. Hands in, hands in. He wants, he wants to fill your hands. Stop, man. Ask the question. <laughs> all right, Kenny. Have you ever had beef, real beef, with any of the members here in the beta squad? Yeah. Uh, can you just point out who the person was here that you had beef with? I'd say Nico. All right, tell me. So this was in Northwood House. Someone stole his PS5. I asked someone, does anyone want this PS5 because Michael's gonna take it. Michael took it, but he took the wrong PS5 and it was Nico's PS5. So Nico came back, he was annoyed. Me and Nico got in an argument. Long story short, we just squashed the beef. How was it resolved? I don't even think it was ever resolved. <laughs> We just got over it. We just forgot about it. But we was like, we were, we were beefing over it. This is tense, because whatever Aja says now, we're going to find out a winner. I think you are telling the truth. The best liar in Beta Squad. No, no, you know what? He got me. He was telling truths in some areas because I've heard some stuff. That's what a master liar does. You know, right? These are classic telltale <laughs> <laughs> I knew this man had potential the minute I saw him. Well, yo, you're scary now. I actually believed you. No, because it actually happened. Shut up, me little liar. Congratulations to be such a good liar. Is there anything you want to say to the camera? Play the trailer. It seems you were sent by Kenny's lies because uh, there is no trailer. Uh, it, the title was um, Guess the Liar, and uh, Kenny just lied to you guys. There's no trailer.